here we have this USB data cable well usually USBs don't have ferrite core inside well just cut it cut the cable and now we will see inside this outer shell is made up of uh, rubber but still it's it's hard to remove it's taking much effort well here we are done but uh, i can't see any fry road inside maybe it's into different fragments now sometimes it comes into uh, into two I mean two fragments let's cut once more oh, no. I don't think it has any any fried road inside it was just a rubber, a, a solid rubber and nothing at all. Yeah, yeah you can see it's just a rubber. I don't know the purpose of this, why, why they keep uh, maybe to fool people or what. Now here I have this 12 volt adapter. It has this uh, ferrite core maybe, uh, we will see inside. First of all we will cut this cable. And now we will remove the outer shell. It's even hard. So it's just a rubber but it's still hard it's gonna take more even even more efforts little bit more efforts oh, oh, the knife broke as you can see on left just a little bit more efforts it's quite difficult to remove ok here we have uh, removed this this shining surface uh, this shining thing is actually a ferrite rod you can hear it's it's a solid solid cylinder like thing yeah you can see it looks nice ferrite rods are actually made from iron oxide and it fits uh, outside this cable this way and uh, it works as a noise remover or, uh, or in other words you can say uh, it, it filter out the unwanted signals it's a little bit attracted towards the iron and strongly strongly attracted towards the magnets as it's a paramagnetic compound 
strongly attracted towards the magnets. Uh, if you have any idea of uh, DIYs about this ferrorod, you can share up with us and ensure to subscribe to our channel. Hello guys, here are my friends Ilya and Hugen. They are IT student at People's Friendship University in Moscow. They are helping me with my YouTube channel and also I need some attention from you guys. Please subscribe my channel and share it to your friends. See you in next video.